The term 5G is no longer uncommon, and 5G mobile phones have also entered thousands of households, but there is one technology that has not yet been implemented, that is, 5G double card double for double pass. The ultimate form of dual card, dual card, slot, dual standby, mobile, dual pass, connection. In 2004, the world's first dual SIM mobile phone was born. The earliest dual SIM mobile phone was dual SIM single standby. In 2005, dual SIM dual standby mobile phones appeared. Entering the 4G era, the market share of dual SIM dual standby mobile phones has further increased. In 2016, the market accounted for over 80%. In the 5G era, dual 5G dual SIM dual standby was quickly realized on the basis of 4G dual SIM dual standby. However, the dual card dual standby dual pass of dual 5G has not been realized for a long time, and it has always stayed in the dual 5G dual card dual standby single pass stage. Until last year, MediaTek took the lead in launching dual 5G dual card dual pass, including various combinations of dual 5G and 4G, and finally realized dual 5G dual card dual pass. It is worth mentioning that the dual 5G dual card dual standby is also the first launch of MediaTek. So, what are the advantages of dual card dual pass? Take two examples. With dual card dual pass, when card 1 uses data services to play games, card 2 can still answer or make calls at will, and the smooth gameplay is not affected. When card 1 is on a call, card 2 the call comes in and rings normally. Dual card dual pass provides mobile phone users with two active communication links at the same time, reduces business interruption, and has obvious value. Guys, how many cards are tied to your mobile phones now?